So finally, we are doing this video. I'm going to talk about 10 weird things about my husband. Now, what I want you to do in the comments of this video is that I want to know anything you feel is extremely weird and you feel differently or you do differently. Just let me know in the comments. Okay, let's start. Okay, so the weirdest thing about my husband, let's keep it on the top of the list. And that is that he has is his own religion. Yeah. And by religion, I mean two things here. First, his way of life and second his philosophy of life okay he has actually documented it he has it in written i'm gonna share a doc in the comments sorry in the description of this video you can go and check it out you can read it through if you want to so the next one is called random locations it's it's weird it's super weird so what he does is he's coded or tool for himself that he uses on his phone i'm not providing that link because i feel it's dangerous and it should be used with a lot of responsibility so that tool what it does is that each time you step out of your house it suggests you a random location around your house so you can set the parameter of 10 kilometers 5 kilometers 15 kilometers and within the radius of 10 or 15 or 5 kilometers whatever you have feeded it gives you a random location on the map and it takes you through the map to that location. And then when you reach the location, there is a list of tasks that you have to accomplish, like eating at a new cafe, go and visiting, visiting a new park. That tool can take you anywhere. It, it could be a forest area. So yeah, you've got to be a little careful. Yes, that's what he does. Um, moving on to the next one. And that is a phone launcher app. He uses a phone launcher app. This is how the screen of his phone looks like. So he just has two apps on the top, which he has to use very frequently. Otherwise, all the apps are hidden behind and he does not have a lot of nice access to it because of which his phone usage has decreased a lot. It, uh, it I mean, his phone usage of entire day is, I guess, around... 45 minutes or 50 minutes, one hour at the max. Moving on to the next one. Our car dicky, you know what a dicky is, right? So our car storage has at least sport equipment, sports equipment of around 15 to 20 sports or maybe more. I have not counted. So there are such peculiar sports he has picked up from around the world. He studies a lot about them and he figures out new sports and then he gets the equipment and he plays it with random kids on the roads. I'll mention a few names to you. There's bocce, there's pickleball, there's shooting. We have those I mean, guns, not the real ones. And then there is hoverboard and then there are drones. God knows what all is there in that car dicky. He has his own feed. He does not have any social media account. He does not use Instagram. He does not use Facebook. He doesn't use LinkedIn. He uses nothing at all. So what he uses is a feed that he has made for himself. He's coded it for himself. He uses that feed. I can give you the link in the description of this video. It has been created by using APIs of various websites. So there are websites like Reddit, and you have uh, Hacker News, you have Tech Meme and all these uh, different coding and uh, in news related websites. Those websites have been linked to that one tool that he uses and uh, we call it Feedium. That's, that's the name that he has given to it. He uses Feedium for his feed. Another one is that he has a habit of noting things down. He writes a lot and he has those small notes at least some 25 50, 30 50 thousand notes that he's written till date actually do not have a count of that there's so many and uh, he maintains them all in a website that he's created on his own and all of those notes are stored there and he just randomly visits those notes and reads through whatever he had written in the past um okay there's one more thing that i'm going to tell you in the next point and that is that he coins his own words now coining words mean that he creates his own words like for instance i'll explain you a word and that is expertise expertise means experience potential expertise is not a real word he's made that so expertise means how much of experience you can derive out of a certain thing for example um, expertise of a kindle is much more than a book 
a hard copy that you have in your hand because kindle can give you hell lot of more experience of reading lots and lots of more books than just a book so another example could be expertise of a ball can be way more than an apple because apple you eat at once it's gone you can just enjoy it once but a ball can be played for years and years and years that's why expertise of a ball is much more than expertise of an apple there was a video that is still performing very well on our channel that is gb to kb that's the name of the concept i discussed it under the importance of communication skills so that concept of gb to kb was created by my husband next weird thing that he has done and i i don't really god i was just not married to him at that time so i could not stop him from doing this but he bought the same car twice yeah nobody does that he bought exactly the same car in the same color back to back yeah at a distance of around 4 or 5 years so he's bought the same t-shirt gazillion times he's bought the same exact car twice he's got he's bought exactly the same pair of shoes thrice he is very comfortable in the choices he makes he keeps on repeating his choices like he doesn't choose new things it's okay for him to carry on with the same stuff again and again and again he can do it for years i adore that about him he does not listen to the lyrics of songs whenever i make him listen to a song he does not focus on the lyrics at all i have to pinpoint ke bhai mere ko ye wala डियर मेरे को ये वाला सॉन्ग बहुत पसंद है लिसन टू द लिरिक्स एंड इवन देन प्रॉबली इज नॉट गोइंग टू लिसन प्रॉपरली टू द लिरिक्स एंड दैट्स प्रॉबली द रीजन ही कीप्स लिसनिंग टू म्यूजिक फ्रॉम अराउंड द वर्ल्ड सॉन्ग्स वी डू नॉट अंडरस्टैंड द लैंग्वेज वी डू नॉट अंडरस्टैंड देर आर लैंग्वेजेज ही लिसन टू विच I nobody can understand. We don't know that language. Okay, now this one is one of my favorites one, and that is he does a lot of courses and he learns a lot. He is always on with some course or the other. He's done courses on anatomy, magic tricks. He's taught me so much about so many things. There's philosophy involved, history involved, science and human anatomy and magic tricks and. God knows what all. He is very fond of taking coachings. He is professionally learned table tennis. He is in the process of hiring a trainer for lawn tennis. If we can afford, I mean, not just by price but by time, then yeah, taking a professional coaching is a great thing. You could you could really lose yourself in the coaching, lose yourself. And one last thing that I have to mention to you in this video is that he reads at least one page every single day. He's been doing it for years and years and years, and I don't know how many books he's completed. I think more than five hundred or so. I don't know. He reads a lot, and it's because of him that I have developed a fondness for reading. Now I also read. Right now I'm reading this book. I'll show you. It's it's in my bag. I'm reading this. Yeah, so I'm reading Murakami, Norwegian book. Yeah, I forgot to tell you that he learned to juggle. Now you must be wondering why am I looking here? So it's because I have all my. <laughs> I didn't want to forget anything, so I've listed everything down that I wanted to mention in this video. So yeah, so he learned to juggle with balls, and he did that with the help of a spreadsheet. Weirdo. <laughs> he maintained a spreadsheet, and he. recorded his progress using that spreadsheet and eventually in a span of i guess 20 25 days he actually could juggle with the balls you call it juggling right teen balls ke sath jo hota hai aise aise a lot of the content that you see on this channel is written by him yeah so we do it in collaboration but um, primary responsibility of uh, writing the pointers for the video or doing the research lies with him he mm. does the most of it and um, of course i have my inputs on it but he is really good with it he does it very well i really depend on him for that and um, yeah but yeah i don't want to give all the credit to him no i also do some work <laughs> Okay now it's your turn let me know in the comments what is that one thing that you feel is extremely weird about you let me know because i'd love to read it and um that's it thank you bye <laughs>